Part 9, On the Actions and Products of the Brain That is, to return to how the transformer of simple energies into refined ones works, brain. For the nine simple energies, which in the dark mass of the zero phase are nobility in potential, absolutely unconfirmed to myself. When it comes to the brain, we have his work production capacity, or inability, his work force, large, small or none, productive power of his work, simple or increased, his work, observing, thinking and concluding, the products of his work, thought, conclusion, memory and knowledge. All of these brain-related categories are from Karl Marx's capital. The only thing that is important here is to note that material goods do not affect the production of new ones, and in the work of the brain there is no creation of new goods without the existence of old ones, which I call memory. Positive memory is knowledge, and simple memory is a set of information without general significance and meaning. The work production capacity of the brain is, the mind. When the mind is amused by itself, it is, the mind as spirit. When the mind is entertained by the world neutrally or in the interest of the community, it is, mind as reason. When the mind is entertained by the world in the interest of the ego to which it belongs, it is the mind as soul. So, there is one mind and three fields of its action. Let's talk about spirit, reason and soul, but, let's not forget that they don't actually exist, but there are types of mind activity. I explained what the brain does and how it works in my text Karl Marx and the Missing Soul. That's why we continue here.